hey guys welcome back to the channel welcome back to the another video and right now i am running ios 17.2.1 on my iphone and i am getting a really good battery life but many people were commenting that they are getting a really bad battery life they are having battery draining issues after updating to the 17.2.1 well if i show you my battery stats over here I can easily say that this is the one of the best battery life I'm getting on the iOS 17.2.1 in whole iOS 17 series. For example, uh, on this day, I used around 90% uh, of my battery and I got screen on time of 9 hours and 8 minutes using different applications, which means I am getting really good battery life. But still, some of the people are getting really bad battery life so in this video i'm going to talk about some of the solutions and i will also share some of the settings that you need to do to get a good battery life so let's begin this video first thing you need to rely on genuine chargers always try to use the best chargers out there uh, genuine data cable genuine chargers to charge your phone because the every genuine charger or every genuine charger is mfi certified and most of the companies out there are not mfi certified other than the apple and those chargers and uh, data, data cables can cause problem for your iphone so try to stick to the original one i know original one cost a lot but it can keep your battery in a good, good shape so it is very important to use the original charger and original data cable for charging your iPhone. Now moving to the next thing, try to keep your phone more than 20%. Never let it go uh, below 20%. Whenever it is around 20% or 25%, just charge it. Don't take it like to 10% or 0% even. Try to keep the phone at least 30% or 25% is the best one I could say. Never let your iPhone go below 25% and whenever it reaches the threshold of 25% or 20 or 30%, charge your iPhone. This is a really good way to keep your battery health strong of your iPhone. Now I'm also going to share some of the very important settings for you that you can do on your iPhone to get a better battery life. So going into settings, then going to privacy and security over here going to tracking as you can see i have turned off tracking for every other application so turn off tracking for all applications also then go to the all the way down to analytics improvements turn this off as you can see i have turned these all settings off now go to apple advertising also turn this off now go to uh, again go to location services Go all the way down go to system services now customize it according to your use for example i don't use home kit so i don't need a home kit to access my location so location is turned off so customize these locations according to your uh, use also go back go back and then go to uh, general over here then go to the airdrop i always keep my airdrop on receiving off whenever i need to use i turn this on for 10 minutes do this it can also help you to get a better battery life now go back once again go to the background app refresh over here customize these background app refresh settings according to your choice for example i want to get messages at time so for messages background app refresh is on but i don't care about the news so for the news the background app refresh is off you can customize some of these settings and i'm hoping that you will also get a much better battery life just like the way i get and i can easily say i am getting a really good battery life even running on the ios 17.2.1 well that's it from this video i hope this video helps out you in any way possible let me know in the comment section below subscribe to my channel and i will see you in my next video until that take care peace out